All right, YouTube, this is part two of our two-part special of Sean and Joe's Day Out in Mount Laurel on Sunday. I think that's where the title's going to be. So we're at, what's it called? Alice Paul Institute. Alice Paul Institute. It uh, empowers women and girls to accept leadership challenges in their lives, communities, and workplaces. I don't think we're welcome to. It's like some female uh, thing where we have like a ravaging female feminist army coming after us. I'm gonna turn the car around, be ready. Don't threaten yeah. me with a good time. Yeah, we kind of park really close to it. Very convenient. So, I'll get out of the car and we'll try to find it. See you in a little bit. It's a pink house, very feminine. We're within like 20 or so feet. Oh, eight feet now. We're within eight feet of the cache. Uh, there's a bunch of lizards and geckos running around. We, I didn't even know lizards lived in New Jersey. Like, I had no idea geckos were in New Jersey. Hopefully, we can get car insurance off of them. Boom! Lizard joke. Lizard man. Sean's sticking his hand in a pipe. Do you see it? <laughs> Dude, they're so quick. It's right there. It's right by your foot. That's a sn is that a snake? That's not a thing. It looks, like, it looks like a snake. They're all over the place, these lizards. Alright, it says on the website that geocaches between the old building that's fenced in and the newer red building. So we're between those two buildings, and it's Lizard City over here. And Sean is not going to be satisfied until he gets to hold one. Do you like holding a lizard, Sean? They seem like they get pretty close to humans, too. Uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm feeling like it's a rock. Oh shit! Oh shit! I called that alive too. Yes, yeah, Sean. He's two for two today. Pound it. I wasn't expecting that to be that. Let's cover it up. Let's make it really good. That looks too obvious now when you think about it. It's like once yeah, we find, once we find it, it's like. Duh. Yeah. Sean is not pooping in a trench. He's waiting for a lizard to come out from under the house and he's gonna grab it with his ninja like reflexes. Sean is in an epic stare down with a lizard. It's a battle of will and wit. Who's gonna prevail? My guess is a lizard. Oh my god. He went under the corner. Well, I guess Sean won the staring contest because that lizard looked away. <gasps> Suck it, animals. <laughs> We've been out here for like a good hour. We were done geocaching, but Sean was committed to catching a lizard. And he caught a lizard! Look at the little lizard! How do you feel, Sean? Is this one of the proudest moments of your life? Yeah, I'm pretty happy. <laughs> He's gonna bite me. Alright, good job, Sean. You're free to go. So are we done here? Yeah. The thing was, I stuck a stick in there at him. <laughs> I, I, I fully expected him just to go back. <laughs> Alright, so we're done for the day. Uh, our geocaching turned into lizard hunting. hunting. We found two quick uh, geocaches, but most of the video is probably going to be Sean staring at lizards. <laughs>
Yeah, I'm perfectly okay with it. So I thanks for to my day. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Hope you have a lovely day. Any parting words of wisdom? Illuminati. Couldn't say any better myself. <laughs>